Hi YouTubers and you're watching Madness 358's channel and today we're going to talk about koi and goldfish and the subject of temperature namely whether they be kept in cold water or tropical waters this is important because for koi and goldfish mixing them in a community tank um, with tropical fish may mean that they cannot survive apparently that's what a lot of people actually say so this is what I mean. In this video, which is a fair while back, I've got a pleco, discus and koi in the same tank. Both the discus and the pleco were actually only temporary housed in there as they were waiting for their tanks to be fully cycled. But I had comments that they couldn't be kept together. Well, have a look at this pond. It's taken in Cambodia. So what is wrong with it? Well, nothing really except that of the country, Cambodia. As everyone knows, uh, Cambodia is actually a uh, tropical country. And this is not the only place where goldfish and koi live. If you don't believe me, just YouTube search goldfish koi with any country like Singapore, Malaysia, Hawaii any tropical country and you can see what I mean they, they basically live in tropical climates now let's look at Australia out of all the states in Australia only New South Wales which has temperate climate and WA which has tropical and temperature climates are allowed to keep koi in the states of South Australia and Victoria it is actually illegal to keep koi at all and anyone found in possession of it may even get a fine. South Australia and Victoria have cold temperatures anyway, so uh, koi will be pretty much at home in those states if they were released into the waterways. What's not so obvious is the northern states of Queensland and Northern Territory. They both have um, subtropical climates to tropical, especially if you live in Darwin. And in those states, it's pretty much warm. If koi are considered cold water fish, then why in those two states of Northern Territory and Queensland are they actually banned? The reason being is that goldfish and koi will live in those tropical climates. So in conclusion, just because they tolerate cold temperatures does not mean they need to be kept at cold water, strictly speaking. Koi and goldfish are hardy fish and can adapt to a wide variety of temperatures. To stigmatise them as cold water fish is really doing, doing them actual injustice. I suppose this, this is YouTube and everyone and anyone can voice their opinions. And that's the great thing about YouTube. Um, you can disagree and agree with what I'm saying. But if you do disagree with what I'm saying, that's okay. But bear in mind, when you do go to those tropical places and do find koi and goldfish in those areas, bear in mind what I said and the fact that they can live in those warmer temperatures quite easily as well. So um, I hope you find this video informative and Please subscribe and like and disagree if you must. Thanks.